Hello, my name is Stephanie, and this is part three of the 13 pound box of jewelry purchased online at shopgoodwill.com. So, here is another necklace. This one is silver tone, very shiny statement necklace. Still in really good condition. Here's the clasp. There are no marks on this, no tags on this. And here is a necklace on a cord. And that says, I can do anything through him who gives me strength. And there's a cross, some beads. Okay, this is an enameled cross. Okay, another necklace on a cord, or this is uh, more of a rope. And that looks like it has a porcelain charm on it. Um, I think it's rose. Some plastic beads. Okay, here is a necklace, and I think this is a sponge in here. It looks like something um, kind of like an ink pad. So I think that might be for like. Um, aromatherapy, something or other. I don't see any other marks on this. Okay, so here is a cord necklace with a cross. And there's a nice green rhinestone here, but you could see it is damaged. Uh, I might try to bend it back. Oh, okay. It's really soft probably going to snap off if I keep doing that. Okay, so here it is. This is more of a bronze tone necklace with some nice rhinestones, uh, nice colors in it, and a drop here. And there's a mark on that. Looks like it says NR. Here is. I think these are. I think these are glass. These um, stars could be stone. This one's broken. And this does have a little thing like right here. And that says uh, 925. And I do see a tiny mark right there, and I'm guessing that's going to say 925 as well. Okay, here is necklace, another, um, well I guess this is a gold tone necklace. And this is a dyed stone, it's very cold. Um, but I do not think it's turquoise. And I don't see any marks on that. It's a necklace on a suede cord. And then there's some shell and a flower.
another gold tone necklace. And these are plastic. And it is in good condition, still able to use it. I do see something here. And again, I think it says NR. Yeah, I think it is a. Uh, says NR. Okay, necklace with some charms. And looks like a star. Is this is an elephant eye and a moon. And here is multi-strand necklace that has um, pink, black, and silver tone ball chain. Looks like the clasp might need some cleaning up, but other than that, it's still in pretty good condition. A little uh, beaded glass necklace. And this, okay, I do see a tag here. This looks like the letter V. Is that focusing? No. Okay, there you go. It looks like it is the letter V. And there are some cat eye beads, and I think these are all uh, plastic. Yeah, they feel plasticky, but maybe these these ones might be glass. Can I? Okay, here is a necklace with some charms on it. I'll try to find the end. Okay, I think it's supposed to go something like this. Something like that. Got the key, some plastic um, beads. And this one has the AB finish on it. And there's the key. This is a necklace with some hearts. Here's a butterfly and a flower. And this is a black chain, like a gunmetal colored chain. The butterfly is really nice. Okay, that says candies. I think it's a um, shoe company. A necklace with oh, there. Okay, here's a chain, silver tone chain, very lightweight. Yep. And then here is a necklace, and this has some plastic beads, dangly beads on it, and a ribbon. Okay, 
this is a multi-strand necklace with these silvery, um, I don't know, I guess they're beads. It goes that way. Another necklace here. This one's pretty nice, still in good condition. Oh no, got some wear on the clasp. But I think we could just replace the clasp and it should be okay. Oh no, this part of the chain is also has a lot of wear to it. This part down here is okay. So maybe you just replace this whole back end. Okay, here are some, I think these are glass. Very cute colors. And let's see, yeah, I think these are glass. I'm not sure about the little ones in between. Um, but these colorful ones seem to be. And this is just one really long necklace, no clasp on it. Okay, another of these magnet house. Um, I think if you've seen in the previous video, we had some, some of these magnet house necklaces. And the thing is these um, middle parts come out. And I guess they are interchangeable with some um, magnets. So that one says ice key. Okay, here is a ring. Gonna focus. Okay, and there's a ring. This is stretch ring. Oh, it's kind of broken. I see the this cord um coming out. But other than that, it was still in good condition. It's not missing any of the finish on here, and it has all of the rhinestones. So I wonder if this is something can, that can be fixed, restrung maybe. And it is a very large ring, look. Huge. Okay. More necklaces. Here is this looks broken. Okay, I see a missing one here, missing rhinestone. And I'm not sure if this is supposed to be separate or if it's falling apart. But these are really nice, these. Okay, there is a name on here. Let's see. E B C M E B Heart C M. Uh, yeah, I don't know if it's broken. Um, either way, it is missing one here. Okay. Oh no. It's all tangled up. Another one of these wire necklaces, plastic beads. Um, these ones kind of feel different though. I don't know if it's plastic or not. It kind of has like a 
like a rubbery finish to it. Okay, here's a chain, I guess double chain all twisted together. Uh, black and gold tone. And this is pretty cute. It's very dainty little chain. Let's see if there's any writing on here. I don't, I don't see anything. And it does stick to the magnet, but still pretty. Okay, so here's the necklace, and I do believe I've seen this in one of the previous videos. I think it's broken, and we had a piece of it in one of the last videos, so here's the rest of it. There is a tag here that I see, and that has, I guess it's the letter H. Okay, so here it is. Glass uh, charm pendant triangle and this is a necklace, silver tone necklace with some. Uh, these are faux pearls. The necklace on a suede cord, and that is um, rose gold tone. And I guess this is supposed to be a like a faux opal. Okay, gold tone necklace with a shell pendant. And there might, yeah, looks like there's two missing things here. Probably um, faux pearls. I guess you can easily replace that. Just glue some new ones in. Here's another necklace, silver tone. Um, has this toggle clasp. So I think you wear it this way. The toggle in the front, because it has these charms here. And these beads are pretty heavy. It has a really nice weight to it. Um, trying to see, I don't think I see any marks on here, but these do need cleaning up. I see it's kind of changing color. Maybe some polishing. And these are Okay, these are glass and I think they, these are a mix of plastic and glass beads. These are really pretty. Okay. A peace sign pendant. Okay, 
Okay, there's a mark on this part. Okay, you could kind of see it. It says Korea. Okay, here's another necklace. And I guess it's tangled. It's a little tangled, I think. It's supposed to, I could see it kind of does this, but this something's going on here that's a little twisted. Um, but other than that, I think it's still in good condition. So I think once I get this um, sorted out, it'll be okay. That's a nice necklace. Okay, here's another necklace. And this again is on a black tone. And there are some black rhinestones as well, the drop. And it looks pretty. It has kind of a vine look to it. Is there a tag on here? Yes. Do you see a tag on that? And that says Monet. I know it's out of focus, but okay, there we go. It says Monet. And the back also says Monet. Upside down, but okay. it's still in good condition too. It's very nice. And this one, okay, I think it's a little tangled, but you can see the charms on here. There's some flowers, a clock, and this uh, fabric flower, and some keys. There's a lock here as well. necklace. Oh, I guess this is the front that has these rhinestones. Um, but this is plastic. Okay, here is a gold tone necklace. And this looks, um, needs reshaping here. It's a little bent and I think you can take, yeah, so you could take this out, probably put some beads or something on here. Um, and the chain is pretty nice too. It does stick. There is a name on here. And that says Avon. Um, so yeah, it, it is kind of losing its finish a little bit on the clasp. But other than that, it's pretty good. The chain. Okay, and here is another necklace. This one has a snake chain. And the pendant, there might be something missing on here. Kind of see this is broken. Gold tone chain. Oh, it doesn't stick. Um, trying to look to see if there's any marks on this clasp, but I don't see any, and you could see the gold finishes coming off, so it might be maybe just gold plated with silver underneath or something different type of metal that doesn't stick. 
Okay, another one of these magnet house necklaces. This one has the letter P. Oh, there's another one underneath. Little chicks. Okay, can't quite get to the back, but maybe if I pull the magnet off with this. Okay, yeah, there's nothing back there. Okay, here is another necklace on a snake chain. And that needs a lot of cleaning. Let's see, it's kind of changing color there. Um, here's the pendant. Don't see any marks on that. Okay, we have a bracelet. Clamper bracelet, and I think it is missing something here. Looks like um, something was broken off. A ring, stretchy ring, and you can see changing colors. A gold tone necklace. And I see a tag here. And that one says Napier. Gonna focus. Okay, so that says Napier. And there's a closer look at the chain and the pendant. Okay, here's another necklace. And this one has some purple, uh, I think they might be glass or crystals um, with the drop. This is really pretty. It has a double chain right here. This one's twisted. Okay, there you go. And there are different shades of purple. So this one's more of a red and then a pink. So there's a tag here. Let's see what that says. Okay, it's LC. Another necklace. Okay, this one's the back. There you go. Here's a little necklace, and this is, this is an owl, it's a rhinestone owl with some blue eyes. This one's really pretty. I really see a lot of owls, but um, get kind of tired of seeing owls, but this one's really cute. Okay, and then there is a tag on here. And I feel like I've seen this tag before, um, but I have not been able to translate it. Um, this is a really cute necklace, little pendant or little charm. Let me see if this sticks. Oh, it doesn't stick. So 
It could be silver. I'll go ahead and get that tested. Okay, here is Unicorn, a silver tone chain. And the necklace with, I think this is all one necklace, just a lot of charms all tangled up. It's a heart, a bow, lock and key. See if you can see that a little better. Okay, there's the rose. 